Okay, we're going to ask mechanic uh, Mr. Kelly Potter here to uh, describe the IndyCar steering wheel to us. So, here we go. All right, here we go. This is the actual race wheel of, I believe, Danica Patrick. Okay. Now, every wheel has paddle shifts. A couple years ago, they went away from uh, traditional gear shifting, which is lever down here. Right. They went to these paddle shifts because of safety. Okay. Drivers don't have to take their hands off the wheel. So we have up shift, That's down right. shift. Okay, up shift on the right, down shift on the left. Yep. Oh, okay. Now over here, these carbon fiber paddles, this is for overtake. This actually makes the car go to full ridge. On the right, underneath. Okay. Yep. All right. That is overtake button. This is to talk to us on the, on the radio. Okay, that's how they use the radio yeah. right there. They don't still don't have to take their hands off the wheel. They can talk, can drive at the same time. Right. This button is fuel reset. Okay. That's fuel. So there after every pit stop, they push the fuel reset, sets the fuel to zero. That way they can start counting down the actual fuel mileage. Okay, so right there, that with that button is how they count the mileage. They reset they that. They reset and, it yeah. at okay. zero. All right. So when you if, if you ever hear an in-car radio, you'll hear uh, reset fuel. They hit okay. that button. All right. That's their drink button. They can actually get a drink of water as they race. There's oh, okay. a tube that goes from electric motor to an actual camel bag, goes around their side of their neck, into their helmet, Okay, and that can actually get a drink. That activates it, okay. Yeah. That's neutral button, so in pit stops, when they come in, car raises up, hit neutral, that way the car's tires aren't spinning while we're trying to change them. Okay, so neutral, okay. Getting some glare there sometimes. Oh, okay, go ahead. Okay. Now, this button right here is for the page. Now, these screens right here will uh -huh. all change and read different things. Okay, that's digital readout. Yes. Okay. So, screens, like, it will hit that button and it will read, like, water temperature, oil temperature, and fuel, or where our weight jacker's at. <coughs> that would be, like, a mechanics page. Okay. Now, race page would show RPMs and other stuff, the driver, what they want. So okay. each driver is kind of catered to what they want on their wheel. So, and when you say page, that means like sort of like almost like the page of a book, like a page exactly. on the screen. Yep, yep. Okay, not like you're paging somebody. Nope. But, okay, yeah, all right. So we'll do that. Now these are shift lights, so they'll actually go together, and when you need to shift your points, these will light up. Now these can okay. be fuel lights, these can be different, depending on the driver. So they set them up differently? Huh? Yeah, they okay. can. All right. That window right there is actually tells you what gear you're in okay so there's six gears so it'll read n or one through six okay now this button right here is pit lane speed so when they enter the pits bam they can hit the gas yeah. as hard as they want the car won't go any faster that keeps them. them from getting a violation yes right? okay so that right. keeps it there now these two buttons right here are for your weight jacker. They can actually control moving actually weight from the right rear of the car to the left front of the car. Really? There's actually a mechanical slave on one of the springs that they can actually increase weight wherever they want. So they can adjust the set setup of the car from yeah, inside? To, to some degree. They can okay. move, you know, X amount of pounds or whatever they want to do, or they can actually change the ride height a little bit. Okay. Depending on how the car's set up. Right. So, it's with those two buttons. Okay. Very cool. And that's pretty much it. Okay. And you say these lights here... Um, those that, are your shift shift indicators. That tells them when to shift. Yes. And do they only light up when it's time to shift? Or? No, they'll stay lit when it's in certain RPMs. Okay. So, they stay lit all the time. And then but, when it gets to a certain point, they know... Yeah, to, they'll go turn red. Turn red so on the inside? Like, or? Yeah, it'll go green, yellow, red. On the inside, of uh, both sides. Yeah. Okay. All right. So that way, cool. the driver doesn't have to rely on on hearing. It actually okay. set up. They actually time the gears and everything to create the maximum shift point every time. Okay. Every track. Very neat. Hey, well, thanks a lot. I appreciate it. All right.